In the town of Bethlehem, there was a certain family. The man's name was Elimelech. His wife's name was named Naomi, and their two sons were called Malon and Kilian. A famine had struck Bethlehem, so the family was forced to leave Bethlehem and search for a fertile land to live in. They went to the country of Moab, a land that was filled with pagans, and they settled there and they grew spacious there. But then a sudden illness struck down Elimelech and he died. Years later, Malon and Killian came to their mother and told her that they decided to get married, and their dream came true. They finally got married. The two sons married Moabite women, one of them married Orpah, and the other married Ruth, and Naomi's hopes for a huge family was coming true. But within months of their marriages, both Malon and Kilion died, and Naomi's hopes for a huge family vanished. Why is God doing this to us? What have we done wrong? I must return to Bethlehem. My family line ended here in Moab. God has surely dealt bitterly with me. I have nothing left. You still have us. We want to go with you. Why should you go with me? Can I give birth to other sons who could grow up to be your husbands? No, you should go back home to your family. Okay, Naomi. I'll never forget you. Ruth, don't you see? Orpah is going back to her family. You should follow her and go back to your mother. No, you are my mother now. I will go wherever you go. I will live wherever you live. Your people will be my people, and your God will be my God. Where you die, I will die, and where you're buried, I'll be buried. So this is what Bethlehem looks like. Yes, but you must be careful. My people hate Moabites. They will kill you.